what's going on guys and welcome back to the long dark so last we left off I was sleeping and I just overslept a little bit now I need to eat some food so I read the comments on the last episode and there's a lot of great constructive criticism that I got that I read and I have come to find out that I should really drop a lot of these cans of food um, they weigh a lot and apparently I won't get all of the stuff out of them and it's just not really worth my time. I did re just now realize that I do have a fuck ton of cans of food. Um, oh god, I got thirsty. Uh, shit. I just ate instead of drinking. Drink. Quick. Drink. Awesome. Okay. Um, so I'm gonna drop a bunch of these cans. Not on the ground. Because you guys said I should put it somewhere, that way there is a way I could come back here if I absolutely needed to. So that's what I'm going to do. I'm going to drop them somewhere else. In like a cabinet or something. Alright? I'm listening to you guys as much as I possibly can. And then there's going to be something else that I'll do wrong and then you guys are going to have to teach me again. Because, you know, I can't learn everything unless I play the shit out of the game. And sometimes I don't have time to just play the shit out of the game. So, I guess this is kind of what we're forced to do is just to... To, yeah, woo! All right, let's gonna we're gonna refuel our lantern real quick. I would say I'm amateur, but I'm not noob. You know what I mean? I kind of know what I'm doing, but I kind of don't know what I'm doing at the same time. So, if that's a good, I would say amateur is the closest I can get. We're gonna refuel this. It is very late at night in the game. Uh, I am not traveling at night. And also, a lot of people are like, well, it is called Pleasant Valley, meaning it's a valley, and I'm by a lake, so I need to head up. I need to not, I need to go towards the mountains that I, the old area's in, and I need to look for it over there. So food and drink, you're saying pretty much all of this should just go over here. Hopefully we are correct in saying that this is what I should be doing. But that's just what I read. I have a ton of energy bars. Dog food, They people also said that I will never need to eat that unless absolutely necessary. Um, Tin of sardines, we'll keep those. And I think our weight should be good now. Awesome, yes. Okay, so that was the problem. Thank you, guys. Thank you. Um, The thing is, I kind of want to just sleep till morning. It's, yeah, we're just going to sleep till morning, and then we're going to, let's smash open some of those cans and just eat those instead of eating the food that we will use when we're traveling, if that makes sense. So let's sleep till 6 a.m. I should have put my lantern out. I'm stupid. I always forget to do that. Okay, it should be kind of bright. Awesome. Thirst is overloading. Um, I think I dr dropped that water somewhere. You know what? I think there might be a toilet in this building, too. I think there might be a toilet here. I remember there being a toilet. Let's take all of it. And let's drink that so that we're no longer thirsty. Awesome. There we go. And then we have a little bit of hunger. What we're going to do is just crack open one of those uh, cans of peaches real quick. And then we are just going to eat that because we don't plan on traveling with this in our inventory. Uh, let's use the hatchet. Well, we're not going to get all of it out of it, but we're going to get a lot out of it. And it's going to give us a good chunk of calories. So, 450 calories. Not bad. Good for traveling. Um, and we're good to go. Okay. So remember that it's in this cabin, uh, across from the Canadian flag. That's that's pretty much how I'm gonna look at it. We got some lantern fuel for our lantern, and where is said exit? Somewhere over here, right? Awesome. So we need to head up. We need to head up that little path that I saw before, that little log path. I'm gonna head up there, and that should be the way to go. Okay, we do have a blizzard. We have pretty high wind chill right now. Okay, so we're right here, right? Like a logger's camp type thing? Okay, this is the broken down area. Okay, I remember where I am. Kind of remember. I haven't played in like three or four days, guys, so you gotta give me a break with like directions and stuff like that. There's a wolf down there. We're gonna light the lantern because it's gonna keep us a little warm. It's not gonna be crazy warm, but it's gonna be 
at least something. We'll be at least warmer. Yeah, see, we're a little warmer since it's in the corner. There we go, we're only going up twice as fast and not triple. Is this going uphill? That's where we came from. I thought it was going to be that direction and it wasn't. I just scared myself with my own footsteps. We need to pretty much just go as far as we possibly... I just pressed M. What does M do? M lights a match. Okay, I didn't know that. Okay. I was pressing M because I'm so used to spamming it in H1Z1 to see where I am. I don't know why. Just force a habit because I play the shit out of that game. We don't want to head up unless there's a road because we'll sprain our ankles or we'll break something or we'll just get trapped behind a rock or something, so... Cold is not too bad. As long as we keep running, we'll stay a little bit warmer. I hope. I hope that's how it works. It should work like that. You know, sometimes games don't work how they should. Pleasant Valley. Whoever said somebody was like, Pleasant Valley, has it dropped a pin yet in your head? And for some reason, it didn't. When I just hear Pleasant Valley, I just think Pleasant Valley, like the name of a place. And then you think Valley, and you're like, oh, it's a valley, meaning mountains and things like that. In between two mountains. In between mountains, that kind of stuff. And we're down by the water, not in between mountains. And I, I viewed the map for this area. It's pretty much just thin ice everywhere out there. So you can't even get to that side. Um, maybe there's a bug or something that will allow me to get out there, but pretty much you can't. Is there a pathway up? Okay, it does seem like that kind of is a pathway that leads up to this house, and then there's stuff behind it. I think it might be like some kind of like tunnel or cave that we need to go through to get to Pleasant Valley. I'm not sure though. I could be insane. And looks like just a stupid, dumb, big open area. Okay. We're not getting that cold anymore. Not really, but we are. I would search this thing, but we don't need stuff. My mission, unfortunately, a lot of people were just like, all right, you need to calm down. You need to you need to set up a base of operations to head back to you every night to sleep at. Um, just store all your stuff there, etc., etc., etc. At the same time, is this, this is leading up. This is where I came from. I just want to get to the new area because this area is just old. There, there's been constant, consistent series is, is, is in this area, around this area, on this area, etc., etc., you know, I just want to get to the new area. I want to explore something new. Like, I've pretty much already explored all of this. Not all of it, obviously, but a lot of it. So I just want to get to that new area. The new area is, like, as big as the original, like, area that they originally released with the alpha, the early alpha of the game. So the fact that that exists is a pretty cool thing. This is actually where I dropped the flares. I'm going to pick those up now that I have inventory room for them. And this was like the log path that I was talking about, right? Are we like fatigued now? No. We should be good. I'm just running slow. Maybe it's deep snow or something. Yeah, I think it's deep snow. This is the path that I, I found and I wanted to head up. And it seems like a reasonable place to start for the new area. Doesn't seem like a terrible place to start. I know the old area is to the farther to the left. Which makes me think the new area would be on the right. Right? Is that reasonable to think? I'm not sure. Maybe I'm just really stupid. Looks like a new day is dawning. A new day is dawning. Look at that. A new day, another day. Isn't that what they say? Something like that. Okay, over there seems very not an area for us to go. I want to loot this building real quick, actually. Warm up inside, maybe light a fire if we need to. Yeah, that just leads back to where we came from. We need to get higher up, I think. Ooh, what's that up there? Ooh, that looks cool. Okay. Let's loot this real quick. Maybe there's something we can light to make us a little warm inside. A little warm and fuzzy inside. An older bar. I'm gonna take the wood because wood is kind of hard to come by. I know you can scavenge for it. 
energy bar. So we're looking for more like portable stuff. I guess it makes sense that we would just bring energy bars and like granola bars and stuff with us because it doesn't weigh a lot, you know? We could have three energy bars for every like can of soup that we have. We're warming up a little bit. We're going to chill in here for a little bit. Uh, I'm going to drink a soda and just like something real quick. We'll just eat a granola bar. Drink a soda. Do we have any soda left? Hmm, we're out of soda. We still have lead, uh, a liter and a half of water, so that's not too bad. We are out of water. Like the uh, soda. Our water's not bad, though. We're just going to wait for our heat to go down a little bit. I wish they kind of had like a story and some lore in this game. I know they're adding it later. Um, but when that does come out, it's going to be a really, really cool game. Right now, it's just pure survival, so... All right, once this gets green, we'll head out. We're just going to chill for a minute. I don't think I missed anything under the beds. I know I've always found, like, MREs under the beds and shit, too, so. Nope, nothing. And I think we should just go now. I just want to find that new area. Hopefully we don't get attacked by any wolves so we don't have to waste another bullet. And when we do kill a wolf, or when we do kill a deer, we should get their pelts and stuff, is what I was told as well. Just drop something else for the wolf meat, cook it later, and it's a lot more food than you would ever need if you keep it on yourself. And also, you can take the wolf meat. Once you waste a bullet, you could take the wolf meat and drop that wolf meat for another wolf to distract him later. So you're better off taking the wolf meat if you shoot the bullet. I know that now. My inventory room wasn't exactly perfect last time, so I didn't want to pick it up. Okay, now that path is going up again. Huh. Okay. Okay. This looks promising. This looks reasonably promising. Is this going to lead to the new area or is it going to lead to like a random building? That's the honest question. I really don't know. I'm tired, Obi. Not that tired. Should be able to last through the day. Okay, and then it takes a left. Right, it's getting it's getting very valley-ish, if that's a word. Definitely isn't, but it is. I made it up. Okay, and it seems like it's going back down. Or maybe it's just looping around this rock or something. Alright, it kind of opened up into an area. Okay. There's no buildings up here, which is, I don't know, if promising or not promising. The lantern went out. All right, that's fine. We don't need to deal with the lantern right now. It's not that cold outside. Only feels like negative three. Not too shabby. Hello, anybody home? Any Pleasant Valleyers here? Hello? No? Take that as a no. Okay, is that road going to bring us left or is it going to bring us right? What is that? Is that part of a rock? It looks like a chest. Looks like a treasure trove. Is that even part of like a road? Yeah, that's like a fence that leads us into an area. Yeah, it's leading us left. Seems like this is kind of bringing us back to the original area. I looked up maps and stuff online and I read most of the comments and nobody really pointed me into the direction of Pleasant Valley. But people said up. Just go up. So that's what we're going to do for the next episodes. Just keep heading up and trying to find it. There's no, like, clear map that said, go this way from here, or anything like that, so. We're just going to check this little, uh, lookout post. Because it sees everything. Okay, maybe there's some stuff inside. Maybe some more rifle ammo or a better rifle than what we have. Better condition, you know? Lookout sounds like a good rifle location. There is a pot belly stove in there if we want to get warm. We do need to eat and drink and stuff. Where is the damn door? There it is. Close the door. That's where a rifle would go. So I don't think there's going to be a rifle here. Got some wood. Got a bed. Hunting knife. Damn. I don't mind a hunting knife. A rifle round. Some wood. All right, we're not getting cold anymore. We're getting a little tired and thirsty. A little hungry. We did just pick up a soda that we can drink. Go ahead and drink that. See what that does for our food and hunger. 
Not bad. Fatigue and cold were just going to warm up inside for a little bit. This wouldn't be a bad place to spend the night, uh, but it is 9 a.m., so not quite worth it. All right. Pretty cool in here. Um, I assume we should just keep heading down the way we came. Maybe we'll find something. We're encumbered. What did we pick up? The knife over encumbered us. Um, let's just eat another energy bar. There we go. We should, we're, we're 30 out of 30, so we're not encumbered. We're pretty much where we should be. But as fatigue, as we get fatigued, we're not going to be able to carry as much, so... Our condition has came back to 100% since we got attacked by that that last wolf. So that's a pretty good accomplishment. We came from 10% to 100% again. So my health is pretty damn good. We could survive another wolf attack if we got surprised and wasn't able to shoot him. Um, hopefully we are able to shoot him. We have eight bullets. We're going to have to repair this rifle, though, uh, with scrap metal pretty soon. I do pick up, I did pick up a lot of reclaimed wood, so if we do get encumbered, I will just drop the reclaimed wood, or maybe drink some of the water that we have, the heavier bottled water that we have picked up over time. I also have a flare, which I believe scares away wolves as well, so not a bad plan. Up there, why is up there, why is up here calling to me? can't jump, so, like, if I can't run up there, then it's not a place I can go. Okay. Pleasant Valley. Game. Okay, this looks promising. And that splits right. Ooh. Did we find? Did we find Pleasant Valley? Looks like a valley, right? There's some mountains, and it goes into the mountains. Please? That leads down. We don't want to go down. Ooh, oh, whoa. Okay. This is different. This is, oh, whoops, just threw that on accident. Give me it back. I didn't light it yet, so we're good. Oh, travel the Pleasant Valley. <gasps> Guys, we found it. That was really loud, I'm sorry. I'm just really excited. He abandoned mine. Ooh, that's cool. A little foggier over here, though. Nope, not falling down there. We've discovered it now, though. Now we can spawn here if we die. Hopefully we don't die. But if we do, we can spawn here. Alright. I'm, I'm down. We found Pleasant Valley. Oh. We just needed to head up. Thank you for the comments. I appreciate them. Like I said, I, I probably read more comments on The Long Dark than I do any other series. Most series are people complaining about things, and then Long Dark is just a whole bunch of people trying to help me, so... You Long Dark viewers, I appreciate it. I appreciate it. Seriously, I do. Where do we go? Hello? Anybody home? We are encumbered. As we're getting tired, huh? Didn't I say I was gonna, like, drink some of this? It's not going to drink a whole amount. It's going to drink until I'm not thirsty anymore. To at least put us under, you know? Alright, I guess we'll just go right. We press four. What do we drop? Beef jerky. Was, would that would that distract a wolf? I think it would, right? I think it chooses the, the best thing to attract a wolf. Pleasant Valley seems very just valley-ish. That makes sense. It's just very open. Uh, maybe there's a road. I hope there's a road. Something I kind of like work off of. Maybe if we just he keep heading in, we'll find a road. Hello, road. Whoa. Okay, there's a road down there. Is there a way down to that road? That is the, uh, the question of the day. Well, maybe there is, maybe there isn't. Maybe I'm going the wrong way to get down to the road. Who knows? Never been to Pleasant Valley. We will learn. I need to light a fire and sleep some. Sleeping is our next priority. We need some kind of building to sleep in. We could always just roll out whatever we got right in the middle of the snow, but that's not exactly safe. Do I trust my ankles? I do. Go, go, go. Oh, God. 
I can see my footsteps, but I can't see my feet. Awkward. All right. Never noticed that. Okay. Ooh. A cabin. Ooh, the road. Is that the road? Yeah, it is. Okay, we found a cabin that we can sleep in. Rural crossroads. Well, now we actually kind of know where we are. Oh, Canada. All right. We're inside. Awesome. Not going to really loot much. I just want to get to the bed. Ah, oh, there it is. Looks very nice. Very nice in here. And uh, I'm going to eat before bed. Usually you shouldn't eat before bed, but in this instance, it's okay. There we go. And we're just going to, you know, get some sleep. So, yeah.